Mycoplasma pneumonia differs from other types of pneumonia in several ways. Mycoplasma pneumonia often causes milder symptoms compared to typical bacterial pneumonia. It is sometimes referred to as walking pneumonia because it rarely requires hospitalization. The cough associated with mycoplasma pneumonia is usually dry and non-productive, while bacterial pneumonia more commonly causes a cough that produces green, yellow, or bloody mucus. Fever with typical bacterial pneumonia is usually accompanied by chills and shivering, which are less commonly seen in mycoplasma pneumonia. Extrapulmonary manifestations like skin rashes, arthritis, mucositis, and neurologic symptoms are more common with mycoplasma pneumonia compared to other types. Mycoplasma pneumonia most often affects school-aged children and young adults, while bacterial pneumonia is more common in the very young, elderly, and those with chronic illnesses. Symptoms of mycoplasma pneumonia develop gradually over one to three weeks, compared to the abrupt onset of bacterial pneumonia. In summary, mycoplasma pneumonia is a milder, atypical form of pneumonia that primarily affects young people and has a more gradual onset compared to bacterial pneumonia. The cough is usually dry and fever may be high without chills. Thank you for watching. Please subscribe to our channel by clicking the subscription button. If you have any questions, feel free to leave a comment below in the comment section.